Drug overdoses continue to be a cause for concern for communities throughout Ohio and really all across the country. Tonight, a mother and father are hoping their son's fentanyl overdose death could serve as a cautionary tale. NBC4's Rob Sneed joining us live now with the viral picture and a message that they're hoping is going to save lives. Calling their son died less than a year ago, and they're already fighting to save someone else from feeling their pain. A picture is worth a thousand words, and the parents who posted this one hopes this message will save a thousand lives. This is how much fentanyl it takes to kill you. By the way, this is not fentanyl, heroin, or meth. This is my son's ashes. We felt so strongly compelled to let people know the dangers of fentanyl and the potency and how dangerous this stuff really is. Brent and Debbie Gibney found out October 1st, guards at the Franklin County Jail found their son, Brent Gibney, an inmate at the time, unresponsive in a cell. He died three days later, a fentanyl overdose. He grew up in a Christian home, so we tried to give him, you know, all the, the Christian values that were available, and so it was quite a shock for us to see him turn that way. Every time they visit his grave, it reminds them of why they need to continue to push through their grief to save someone else's life. Rob, it's the most horrifying, terrible experience anybody could go through. And that's the reason why we want this message to go out so strong. And, and this is such a dangerous thing. People just aren't listening. I mean, putting that picture on there was a very hard thing to do to have that image of our son on there. And the good news say they will continue to spread the word about the dangers of fentanyl for many years to come. Rob Sneed, NBC4.